Croatian journalist Drago Hadel's groundbreaking stories have exposed war crimes and atrocities in the former Yugoslavia. The price of his fearlessness, death threats, beatings, even accusations of treason. As editor of Croatia's Feral Tribune, a weekly political paper in Split, Hadel has helped expand the limits of press freedom in his country. His paper has been a constant nuisance to the government and a breath of fresh air to the public. And his exposés have often had a provocative effect. Two years ago, he broke the story that a former general, Branislav Glavis, was accused of war crimes. Glavis was head of the municipal defense forces in Osikia when 37 Serb civilians were killed in the early 1990s. Hadel also reported accusations that the general was behind the torture of two men who were beaten and forced to drink sulfuric acid. Both were killed. A formal investigation was opened this past July, but Glavis has yet to be taken into custody, and Hadel says the general has tried three times to intimidate him into silence, once threatening to turn the journalist into dust and ashes. The Tribune faces continuing government pressure to back away from embarrassing stories when it criticized a state prosecutor for saying that Jews had provoked the Holocaust. A Zagreb court ruled last February that the Tribune had criticized the official in an improper manner, imposing more than $40,000 in fines that could bankrupt the paper. In addition to his work for the Feral Tribune, Hadel is a longtime correspondent for Radio Free Europe. His work has also appeared in Time and The Guardian, and he spent several years training young journalists. As he continues to stare down danger, Drago Hadel says his strongest motivation comes from ordinary people who stop him in the street and whisper, please don't give up, we're on your side.